What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. So I am constantly getting emails from bike manufacturers and like Performance Bike and Jensen USA about Black Friday. I feel like I've been getting Black Friday emails for the last three or four weeks. So I had planned on making a Black Friday gravel bike video. There's so many great deals on bikes out there right now. So yesterday when I get home, I'm scrolling through YouTube and I see that Josh, the daily mountain bike rider, he put out a video basically talking about how this is not Black Friday deals. All of these companies have too many bikes because they overstocked because during COVID, when everybody was riding bikes, there was a high demand and there wasn't enough bikes. So these bike manufacturers made all these bikes and now that people aren't riding bikes as much, they can't sell these bikes and they've got all of this stock. So basically they're selling them really, really cheap and they're calling it an early Black Friday deal. Bikes at this point, they are now back down to that pre-COVID price. And honestly, a lot of these bikes are even cheaper than that. If you're looking for a new bike right now is a great time to buy. Josh's video made a ton of sense and I completely agree with him. These are not Black Friday deals. I've been looking at bikes for the last several months. I just am always looking at bikes and they have been this cheap. Yeah, some of them may be a little bit cheaper for Black Friday, but honestly, I don't think very much. And after Black Friday, I do believe these sales are going to continue to happen. So right now, I've got some sites up. Uh, the first site I'm on right now is the Canyon site. Canyon is a consumer direct brand. And as you see, Black Friday, save up to 40%. So they've got you know, all of these sites are blasting Black Friday, trying to say, hey, these are incredible deals, but let's look at Canyon, they make some sweet bikes. So let's shop the sale bikes. The first couple bikes here, they're not, you know, crazy discounted. You've got a, a Grizzle here uh, for uh, 2,800 bucks. You save $500 there. They've got some e-bikes here, the Grail On. You can save 500 on that bike. There's another e-bike right here. This is the Grail On CF8. Save $700, pretty good savings. 200 off, 500 off, yada, yada, yada. So not bad, but not crazy steep discounts. Now let's look at Obed. Obed is another consumer direct brand. So here you go, you go to the Obed site, Black Friday. Big, bold, right there on the front of the website. So you see all the bikes that are on sale uh, have the red there and then the closeout, the really good deals. This is the Boundary GRX 810, $2,595, and uh, normally $3,295. So that's a pretty good deal. So you go down a little bit, you've got the GVR GRX 810 for $2,995, normally 3,800 bucks, pretty good deal. That's their, um, I think more of their all road bike. And here you go, Obed even makes mountain bikes now. All right, now let's hop over to Specialized. I've been visiting the Specialized site for the last several months, not necessarily to buy a bike, just to look at the crazy good deals they have right now. Uh, the Diverge Elite, 1800 bucks, normally 2000, so not great. The Diverge E5 right here, this would be a decent bike, $1,000 for a complete bike, normally 1300. So if you were wanting to try gravel, but you didn't want to like fully dive in and get a super expensive bike, that might be a decent option. Here we go. Here's the Diverge STR Pro, this like orange color, 7,000 bucks, normally $8,700. So that's a pretty good deal. I'm not sure why anyone would buy that bike. Uh, I think this is the whole frame suspension thing is a gimmick, uh, but I've heard some people actually say it works. Probably not something I'm interested in. But here we go, Diverge STR Expert, five grand, normally 6,700. Go to the next page, and you've just got more and more and more deals. Now, let's check out YT. So YT is a mountain bike brand primarily, but they do have a gravel bike in their lineup. Uh, YT has got some crazy good deals right now. Here you go, top of the screen, Black Friday. Save up to 50% on select goods. Uh, their mountain bikes, are, are sick. I have a YT and it's an awesome bike, uh, but they have some really good deals on mountain bikes, like save $2,000 here, save $1,900. I mean, the savings are nuts. They have e-bikes for sale. And these are all the bikes too. I like this site because these bikes are their in stock bikes. So you don't have to like click on the bike and find out what's in stock. Like they have them here. Um, 
So here, the Zepter, I think is how they pronounce that. This is their gravel bike. So if you're a mountain biker, but you want, you're wanting to dabble in gravel and you've got some money to spend, this bike, you save $1,400. It's 31% off. Normally, $4,500. You can get it for $3,100. Jump over to Cannondale. Cannondale, the front of their page. Happy Holidays. So they've got uh, their sale going on too. They've all got a sale going on. We go down, we go down to gravel bikes. Let's go just start looking here. Close out, here we go. So the first three, a frame and two bikes at the top of their website are not on sale. Then you go down, you've got the Topstone Carbon, uh, 3,830 bucks, normally 4,250. I mean, they're all on sale. Not crazy steep discounts here, but um, still better than they were during COVID. They're available and they're a lot cheaper. Here we go, Topstone 4, uh, $1,175, bucks. normally $1,375, that's $200 bucks off. That'd be a pretty sweet bike if you're trying to get into gravel, but not trying to break the bank. All right, Giant, jump over to Giant. Here we go, their website, sale. Giant is, I believe, one of, if not the biggest bike manufacturer in the world. The Revolt, $6,800, bucks. this Revolt X Advanced Pro, $6,800, normally $8,500. That's a sweet deal. Uh, over here, the Revolt Advance, that's only $500 off. So obviously the more expensive the bike is, the more it's probably gonna be discounted. So yeah, some decent deals there on the Giant site. Now let's hop over to Jensen. I get emails all the time from Jensen USA about their deals, um, and they're having some good ones right now. They've got some Niners. This one's 33% off. Uh, this Niner right here is 38% off, 1800 bucks, normally 2900 That's a Niner RLT9. That's pretty sweet. They've even got some salsas here, 13% off. Not a great deal, but they got the Warburg GRX there, kind of one of the OG gravel bikes. Uh, Bianchi, 30% uh, off there. Let's see, this Niner down here, 1600 bucks, normally 2600 Pretty, pretty sweet deal, 38% off. They've got a Marin there. Uh, they've got a GT, GT grade sport. This is their gravel bike, I believe. $900, MSRP 1500, it's 40% off. Pretty good deal. We go over to Backcountry. Backcountry actually deals Cervelos and they are like pretty much all 25 or 26% off. They've got a GT Carbon Elite for 2,000, normally 3,000, 33% off. But I ride a Cervelo, it's behind me right here. I love this bike, so 25% off. That's a pretty sweet deal on those bikes. Here we go. Ridley Frame Set, if you wanna build up a bike, 50% off, $1,300, normally 2,600. All right, and then last side here, Performance Bike. Uh, they've got some basically similar deals that we've seen on the last few pages. And honestly, guys, these are great deals if you're in the market for a new bike. And another thing that Josh said in his video, if you find a bike you love online, or if you find accessories, accessories are super cheap right now too, because not only bikes, but Shimano, these other companies that make bike parts, they've made a lot of bike parts that they cannot sell, so you can find those really, really cheap too. But if you guys find accessories or bikes or whatever online, you know, Josh mentioned this. He said, go to your local bike shop and see if they will match that price. Another thing about a local bike shop is if you find a bike that you like there, they're probably gonna match the online price because they're going to want to sell that bike. And if you go to a local bike shop to buy the bike, you can test ride the bike and you can build a rapport with a bike shop. So definitely check with your local shop before buying stuff online and see if they will price match. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do you think that bikes are going to continue to be cheap? Do you think that they're going to get cheaper because not as many people are riding? But either way, guys, I appreciate you checking out the video. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you have not subscribed to the channel yet, please hit that subscribe button. And until next time, keep crushing it.